Folks, so we've got uh, various dents in the floor where this fridge got uh, dragged across it. And hopefully you can see those. So in the video, we're gonna take those out. We've got an iron. We did a little test piece here, which, uh, you know, I dinged this up quite a bit, but it did raise the surface. So this technique definitely works even on uh, engineered or laminate type flooring. So the other stuff we have besides the iron, rags, water, and so let's go ahead and get into it. This is gonna take a while to do this. Recording. So we're gonna do this spot here. It's pretty long. My dish towel is getting a little bit dry because I was using it yeah. on the other piece. So. so the goal, folks, is to, to put that water pretty much right over the dent. Just about get it to the point where it evaporates all the water, right? And then you're going to do what? Then I'm going to check it, see if I have to do it a couple more times. Okay, it is raising up. It raised up quite a bit. I'll have to maybe do a little touch up on the um, uh, stain, but that that's minor. But this is definitely raised up. I can still see it. We're gonna do one more shot. Okay. That's still nice. I know. So this dent compared to some of the other dents we have is probably gonna be a little more difficult to make perfect. Whereas the ones that are long grooves that don't have all that additional work in there. So what's it looking like so far? Oh wow, that is amazing. Absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna do right in here. Okay. So one lesson we learned from this, folks, if you're going to move your fridge around, put uh, furniture movers over it. Under it. Under it, yeah, permanently, because it will, if you have a big enough fridge, there's enough weight in the fridge to permanently disfigure this wood. Oh my God, that is amazing. That has really raised this Holy up completely. Cow. All right. So my biggest concern, folks, was I would have to pull all this wood out because, um, and start, you know, completely over. But potentially, we might, uh, we might get away with not having to do that. So it's buckling up a little bit. I mean, it's raising it up, but it's also buckling up. This isn't hardwood floor, so I think that's part of why that's like that. Um, I'm gonna try this thinner strip right in here.
Looks a little better. Yeah. Yeah, this buckled it up quite a bit. But that one, potentially with the wax. Yeah, might, that uh, would be what I would do next is the wax. Yeah, that, that portion. Now this is a big dent right there. It was amazing on the, we had a test piece that we did, two out of three came out, or one out of three came out perfect. How's that looking now? Any better? Yeah. So this raised up quite a bit, but it also leaves um, that raised part. Maybe that will settle down after it, um, and this, this is all raised up. It just, um, um, it's like a scuff mark. Yeah. where I'll take a little stain on that. Yeah, and if these were like nothing but, you know, solid hardwood all the way through, you obviously could get it raised up, sand it down, and refinish it, where this stuff, trying to salvage it's another story. That? I said that did really nice on that. But um, the mark is still on there though. Let me see. We'll do this one next. Yeah, I guess, you know, it's going to come down to whether you're going to find it. Hang on, let me get the. Make sure people can get a look at it before you do it. Um, it's going to come down to whether we're willing to accept a slight surface indentation versus a you know like this is kind of a these are major indentations yeah these are major you got a big one over here too oh yeah I'm liking what I'm seeing though I mean it gives us hope that we might be able to sell At least this. maybe, yeah, we can get it to a certain point that's uh, livable with. Between wax or wood filler or something. Look at that one. That one did gorgeous. Yeah. That depends on your, what angle you're looking at it. Right. I mean, you got a spot one more, here and here. One more try, and it might be. Um, I'm gonna wait because it. You got a little bit of bubble there. Do you have a dry towel? Um, I'm gonna go with the, this one over here. All right. So we're moving. Yeah. All right. So we've got our next little. Oh, show the show the uh, dent first. All right. Pretty right here. Yeah. Pretty decent sized one. Actually, it runs. It runs there, this and. way too.
So this is completely raised up, but it it Bubbled. it bubbles it in a sense. So we'll see like when it dries what it will end up being like before we go to the next one. Oh, you're not gonna do the second half of it. I'm gonna wait because right now, I mean, you can play with it if you want. I don't want to put any more heat on that because it is bubbling up a little bit. All right. So. So there's a smaller one over there that you could probably could definitely get out. I want to do it. Yeah, thank you. You quit? Yeah, because I'm not seeing enough uh, results. But we're going to let it dry and then see. So hopefully you can see this. We've got a little, we got some grooves here. I'm just going to shoot for that spot right there. Yeah, part of it could also your be... Your cord is underneath um, your... I gotcha. Way too much water, folks. Oh, way too much water. Um, yeah, I would just uh, let it sit longer. You can wring out your rag if you need to. Well, that actually looks good now. Okay. Yeah. I need a dry rag. Wow. Do you see that one at all? Yeah. How do you see it? Because I don't. From see this it. angle. That's like almost. Right. But perfectly gone. On from this angle. All right. Maybe not. It looks so much better, but it's um. You can still slightly see it there. Let's try it again. So much easier when you were doing this. Well, you need to put your towel out right? in this spot. Just enjoy. trying to get that one spot first. Oh. Yep, that's why you gotta listen. You gotta listen. So it's probably raised as much as it's going to raise. Yeah, so overall, there's only so much you can do with this kind of flooring and iron. But it does, uh, it does make a difference as far as the surface level goes. And so it's almost to the top. But that's going to do it for this video, folks. Hope you got something out of it. Um, maybe not the perfect cure, but uh, definite improvement. Thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe.